hey guys so today we are going to see that uh, how can you use a uh, solid work drawing and uh, how can you give datum to the solid works drawing so generally you know that datums are used to uh, used when we are going to give uh, geometric tolerance to any uh, geometry so we need to first define datums so that it will be very easy for us to determine uh, where we are giving the geometric tolerance so let's start and let's learn how to give a datum indicator line for our geometry so uh, go to file and go to let's say new click on draw click on ok and um, here let's browse a drawing apart file let's say this one click on open and let's place the front view like this so now how to give a datum to this drawing so for that you need to go to this datum feature click on this now you can label datum as per your wish let's uh, label this datum as d so I, I will write here d and you can see the preview here so you can see here the datum the num the the label i make for the datum is d but now i want to uh, label the datum on the part so you can see if i if i drag my mouse you can see that it will going to make like this as you can see so you need to select the you need to select the the um, you need to select the surface for uh, making a datum so let's say we are selecting uh, this surface and click on datum feature and you can see here we are getting that line easily so let's say this is the datum d if you click this you can get that datum feature now again if you like move like this and let's say the next datum is E you can also change the style from here like the this one fill triangle with shoulder and like empty triangle so it depends on you how to how uh, what thing you are choosing like you can see here so it's like this datum E let's say this one we are going to use which is this let's say datum F now let's uh, we can use this one round so let's say this is uh, datum G you can use this horizontal you can use this vertical for this let's say this is the datum H let's go to back and like and let's we can use this one so we haven't given the datum for this one let's say this is datum I and this is the bit this is the general dimension which is generally used which is uh, very easy to understand so I will suggest that you basically stuck on this part and let's say this is the datum J so datum K so in this way you can give the datum feature to your drawing and which is very helpful if you are going to give geometric tolerance to your drawing so stay tuned for more videos when I'm going to upload videos on geometric tolerance on for the SolidWorks drawing. So I hope you will be like this. I hope you you like this video, and thank you for watching the video.